Hey, I'm the Bond Guy, and I am here to introduce you to our newest neighborhood scent, fresh for fall 2016. Bond number nine, Soho. And we are particularly excited about this scent because the Soho district is just below our home on Bond Street, yet it's a world all of its own. The streets of Soho are lined with the world's most luxurious shopping boutiques. It plays home to so many artists' lofts, and it also features the Cast Iron District, which is a group of 500 landmark buildings with that historic and iconic cast iron architecture. This area is the convergence of high-end and edgy style. We've dressed our new Soho bottle with mesmerizing black and white whirlpool swirls, channeling the high-energy, vibrant, gender-free scent inside. It's a mixture of style and scented beauty. It's Bond number nine, Soho. You like this new swirly effect? Yeah, I feel like I'm being hypnotized or something. That's right. <laughs> You're about to be hypnotized and mesmerized by this new scent. Tell me what you think. Oh, wow. That's good. It's like sweet enough for a girl, but not, mas not too masculine, so it's like... You hit it right on the head. We call it gender-free. Oh, wow. It's really? a mixing of all the best of both of the sexes, downtown, yes. Soho, art style architecture. That makes sense. So I would you, definitely buy this. You would? Yeah, 100%. This yes. might be my new set. What do you love about Soho? I think it's awesome. It's like a quirky, unique little area. Quirky, unique little area. That's like the perfect description. It's like fresh, it's like unique. It's centered on uh, this kind of unisex, sexy orange flower so you, so there's matter. like an orange essence in it and then it's also got some deeper notes like oak moss so it's a little bit like fun and playful but then also like dark and romantic because that's kind of soho at night what do you love about soho um i don't know i love i love the little shops i love everything I love, even when i'm walking down the street i love the fashion i love everything oh my gosh it's like it's like it's like it's like it's like I'm sorry, it smells really good. What were you gonna say? What were you gonna I don't know, it's like it's like on the tip of my tongue, but it's like just it's not too strong, but it's it's like I'm here. Like right. it's like I don't know. I don't even know how to describe See, it. You can't come up with the words because we just des we describe it as mesmerizing. Because you're like it's hypnotizing. That really is. I love the neighborhoody feel, you know? It's like really super neighborhood. What do you love about this area? Like the people, there's so much that you can shop around, look at. I really like it. It smells really clean and fresh. Yeah. Clean and fresh. I mean, yeah, I like it. We call it a gender free scent, so it's not skewed either way, masculine or feminine. Yeah, I definitely agree that it's not gender specific, and I definitely agree. Are you visiting from out of town? Yeah. Yes. Where are you guys from? Australia. Australia. That actually yes. is really good. What do you like about it? It's soft. It's soft. It's actually it's soft. soft. It's you soft. like the bottle? Yeah. I know. Does it make? Is it mesmerizing you? Yeah. It's like if I spin around enough, you might get like dizzy. Yeah. Maybe if you spin the bottle. Get We're it, hypnotizing them with fragrance. The Australians are falling for my spell. I have been swirling all around Soho, debuting our new fall 2016 gender-free scent, and tourists and locals all agree that this scent is a perfect mix of high-end style artistry and sensuality as any good New York perfume should be. We can't wait for you to try it. Until next time, I'm your Bond guy.